let's go on to the next episode of Star Citizen. We're in last left off. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. I feel like I'm playing for the first time again. Why? Two reasons. I had to break the fourth wall. I've completely reformatted my computer and the issues are now gone. And we now have the dual stick setup. So what does that mean? Oh, uh, there's WHP in chat. What does that mean? It means on my left hand, there is no longer... I used to use the CH products. Hotas system, a throttle, and flight stick. Now on my left, I have a Thrustmaster 1600M. It's kind of a budget stick, but it's I'm really impressed with it. I'll have an unboxing uh, kind of little video in the near future. And then on my right is the SciTech X56 stick, which I did do an unboxing on the channel. Um, so I'm excited. I'll put a link to both of these sticks in the description below. But I'm very, very excited to uh, try them out here. And uh, we're a little, a little full here in the verse. But, uh... <laughs> Sorry, I'm just reading cat nuts in the, the chat arena. But I'm excited to check it out. I've, I've sampled with it. You know, I'd probably... You know, a big shout out to... Uh, the squad in our community discord who, who helped me get everything ready there's a really good video done by one of our community members <clears throat> that uh, really helped to configure the left joystick because it's not super intuitive I mean once you do it it makes sense but if uh, you're kind of you're not sciencely inclined or you know I don't know it just was it made it really easy to set up and it's probably not something you can figure out or most people wouldn't figure out or want to invest the time to figure it out. Um, when you can watch a video that makes it so much easier. But nonetheless, I've sampled with the uh, with the layout or the new the new joystick and throttle setup in some arena, not arena commander. Yeah, well, in the uh, fly free, just trying to slide in and out of the DMs. So I'm pro this this episode, we're gonna focus on number one. I need to turn the audio down here. I apologize for that. Uh, number one, we're gonna be doing some probably some stunt flying or. Hopefully it doesn't turn into the, the bad bad pilot show. But from my understanding, there is a bit of a learning curve when implementing the dual stick setup, which is completely understandable. It's a brand new way to play. But at the same time, you know, I might maybe have spent an hour or so with the dual stick setup and, and kind of bound to everything that I wanted. And it just feels like you have so much more control and it feels more immersive and it kind of, without saying, I mean, sounding irresponsible, it sounds like, it feels almost like a new game, right? Because you're not playing it with the same inputs that you've played with it before. And um, judging by where we're going here, we don't even know how to, to strike up our ship here. But nonetheless, I did want to, uh, uh, what's going on with the ships? WHP is about to be back in control. And so I don't know what the ship situation is. I'm about to find out. If we have a little binding issue here, I'll probably slide into the DMs. I want the Gladius because it's ripped skins. No. Oh. What's up with the ships? Any taxis available? Uh, maybe we could try to get a big dog. I don't think that'll matter, but yeah, it looks like we're all ripped skins here. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna switch shard arenos here and give it the old college try. But at least you guys you got the debriefing of what to expect. All right, so here we go. We're back in action with a little gladius, and you say, "Hey, Dan, uh, why would uh, you take the gladius out?" And the reason is because I feel like with the dualies, it's one of the more nimble ships uh, that still packs a little bit of a punch, but uh, it allows to hopefully slide in and out of some DMs. We'll start with some basic combat and then probably move over to Korea. Uh, I saw them defending Korea. Lioness, no one defends Korea like WHP. All right, so here we go, our first takeoff, boys, Launch and that complete. new freshness. Landing so my complete. left stick System is bound is to, how do I do this? I need to go up by twisting to the left. To the left. Launch complete. There we go, bo there we go boys. We're in this. Begin scan. Oh, hang in there. Hang in there. Nice and easy. Okay, so the other thing is, so 
Instead of having a throttle, I hold the stick to go forward, dude. Let's, uh, let's get this... This joystick's a little bit tight here. I'm just trying to think. If I have the twist right or not, I don't have this set up, so I'm going to have to probably tweak this. Because uh, it looks a little bit out of sorts here, but nonetheless, let's see if we can remember our new settings. We'll go... Uh, how do we change PRE mode? Landing gear no. retracted. Flare it's like ready. starting all over. Chaff ready. Flare ready. Chaff ready. How do we change our flight mode? There we go. Okay. We got it, boys. All right, hang in there. All right, so left and right spin. I don't. I'm probably gonna have to adjust that. So let's go ahead and do just that. All right, guys, so I do appreciate guys with a little bit of a learning curve. It is almost like, like I said, it's like playing it for the first time. But uh, let's go ahead and squat up here. And we said we wanted to start a little slow here. So let's go ahead and that's our cruise mode. Let's go to the old Comrade 126. Bottom travel. All right, nicely done. So it, takes a, it definitely takes a little bit getting used to, but it, it's kind of like, if you ever go to a PAX, there's this one room where they have, it's like Armored Core, where you sit in this, this get up and you have dual joysticks and pedals, and it's kind of, that's how it feels like for this. The first time is always the, the sleekest, but I, we are going to be doing some training and probably doing some squad stuff to hopefully get better at this, but... I guess, I mean, really, what are we holding off for? We could go right to Korea. Let's actually check our missions here. Let's do a pirate mission here just to get get a little bit of the ring rust off. ICC assistance. We could do that. No comma raised on. All right, so let's go ahead and squat up. So I guess I know what it feels like to be a new player again, huh? Well, let's go over to... Where's the old Tessa Lannister action? She's gotta be over here, huh? There she is. So one of the things that's, that's interesting is that on the bottom of my right joystick is an X56, there's a spring, and it's a little bit tight. So I'm gonna have to swap that out, but nonetheless. Here we go, let's see if we can. UINS blazed. UINS cowards. All right, so let me see if I can slide into the DMs here. So I'm, uh, how do we want to do this? So I can strafe left and right, so strafe right here a little bit. Look at that. It's so much better. UINS blazed. Got him. Tag him. I don't think I can shoot him down with this since we're in... Bad space right now. Hang in there, boys. The aim life. Our strafe life should be so much better. Alright, so we don't want gimbal here. We kind of want to stay on point here. Hang in here, boys. I feel so much control. Ding him up. I don't know how I... I don't... See, I don't have my, my gimbal lock on yet. All right, the other thing we do is we can tag him up. Roast him. Begin scan. Hang in here, boys. Hang in here. Also, I think we have lag and lead pips on. Or we have the lead pips on. Okay. So we got to put those dots on them. We probably see this may be if we went had a saber action. This is probably Tech the best deal. Under here. Fire. Shields recharging. All right, boys. Maybe time for us to. Shields recharging. To squat up. Oh, uh, what's my launch button? Sense of sense of mayo is way. UNIS is. Rear shield under fire. Okay, now how do we how do we deal with a little adversity Shaft here? Drop. Flare ready. Flare drop. Drop. Hang in there. 
it, I feel so much more in control. I know the aim isn't there yet, but I'm just telling you from a ship standpoint, when have we ever been able to keep a Hornet on our screen for that long? Now I just need to get get our lock on here, boys. We got we got a shot. Missile lock. Hang in there. Are we gimbled? I don't think we're gimbled here. Hang in here. I don't think we got credit for that, but works for me, boys. All right, so let's keep our joystick here, north and south. Let's tag Raiden. I feel like we've played with this guy before. We've already hit this guy eight more times than we have in the previous 20 episodes. Now we just got it. If we get... I think our next step now that I'm feeling a little more comfortable in it, and really we're only a little bit into it, is starting to Missile. do some... Uh, starting to build some ships or, or toggle our ships so that all of the weapons have the same velocity, which will then all put us on the same pip, which... It's a way to get it done. Look at that. Overhead We're actually doing fire. damage, boys. Squad up. Hang in here. Head shield under fire. Shields okay, now let's do some evasive maneuvers here. Shields recharge. Wait for him. Missile for him. lock. Squad up. Overhead shield under fire. Shields oh, so we recharge. We did a little, little reverse thrust. Rear shield under fire. Okay, I'm gonna slide some shields to the rear DM. We may have to get out of here, but we'll get some hits in. Okay, we're out of here, boys. Our work here is done. Work here is done. Here we go. Bottom travel. Oh, we took a big hit. Bottom travel. Big hit. Get out of here, boys. Oh. No. <laughs> All right, I gotta, I gotta tweak our quantum settings there. But I'll tell you what, the confidence is higher. And said, "Well, Dan, you got slaughtered." Yeah, but the control, the control is real. The control is real. Oh, <laughs> he's making fun of us. I got rammed. I just, I, I mean, I don't want to talk it up too much because we're early in the infancies, but uh, it definitely, it feels like before I was driving like a dump truck, now I'm a freaking Blue Angel pilot. Alright, let's not get carried away, but let's try our Hornet here and squat up and give us the old college shot because I have to be, you know, very forthright. I think I mentioned this either in a live stream. Or maybe I didn't, or a video, but there got to a point where I would avoid dogfighting just because I felt like I lacked control. Like, it was very difficult for me to aim, but this is like, and I always thought it was maybe on the aiming end of it, meaning, you know, squaring up the ship, but really, the aiming comes more with the positioning of your ship than really the positioning of your target. Not that I'm speaking from, like, some expertise standpoint, just more so from a feel. Like, even just, that was my first true dogfight against a player with the dualies. You know, I killed some Vandal and things like that, but um, I think we got a shot here. My sound's completely gone. Don't talk about WHP. The squad. Aerospace. All All right. systems so online. let's do this. Let me do a little, I should probably do a little demonstration here. So, and I'll, at some point I will do a video like showing, hey, the sticks with the stuff in the, with the stuff in the, uh, so you see like an overlay of my, my joystick and with the, with the ship's doing. So we're going to go twist and go left here. And then I'm going to go joystick forward. I go joystick right, joystick left, joystick down, joystick. So this is forward and back. So really, it's like six degrees of freedom. It's not like it is, which is very nice. So I can do all sorts of tomfoolery. Let me get us out of landing mode here. Which is now just a button away. I like it. Now let's go back to F4 here. 
So unless I hold forward, the ship does not move, which is really nice. Also, I have space break bound. Oh, it's so good. All right, so let's go to Korea here, boys. And the only thing I need to do is maybe move it a little bit closer. All right, 275. So I'm probably going to double tap that. Let me move this mic deal. So I know this is a little bit of a sampling episode, but I'm feeling really good about it. I'm feeling good about our squad. Scanning. Boogie. This is okay, so we got action here. We so I do I do want to tweak area. our scanning. Quantum. So I have the quantum, like to to engage the quantum, I have the left hat up. And then to actually engage it, I have the left hat down. I just need to double click it. That will be way better. And really setting all this up, it made me appreciate how much detail there is that Star Citizen has set up. Or CAG has set up to manage Scanning. the control system that you'd like which is pretty impressive all right should we go for our first landing i don't know if i'm ready for our first landing yet look at that reverse thruster oh <laughs> no i use reverse thruster i use reverse thruster space break boys i should use space break though we're learning we strafe out of here. Alright, so my mic arm is jammed. No! 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 Boogie. Rip skins, boys. Hang in here. Rip audio. Just help me out here, boys. Hang in there. Hang in. Okay. This is not even anywhere close. Okay, so we should have action here. There's this better. Uh, it's close enough. So now I got my mic arm is kind of low, but that's all right. I don't. You guys need to. Let me get out of here. All right, so let's see where we are here. Let's see if we can get ourselves out. So I'd like reverse thrusting. I don't know why our engines. Space break. There we go. I don't know why our engines were firing. Okay, so that's a problem. Did I hit the throttle? So something must be bound to a throttle. Because look at that! Yeah, something's, something's not right here. So why are we going full speed? I must have hit a button. That triggered that. Deployed. Which is not good, but it's okay. We'll we'll deal with it here in a second. Landing gear raised. So something happened so that, because now I'm not even using my left stick, but we're at full speed. So I had to have hit a button. Chat. Online flare. Online. That made that happen. And it's not the throttle. Just start mashing buttons here. Oh, you know what I hit? I hit match speed. That's what it was, boys. Okay, so let's get in this real quick because I feel like we can still slide into the DMs here. So if we go to key bindings, HOTAS, advanced controls, flight, movement. It's a button. I, it's just like match velocity. I don't really care about that. So we need to remove that. Scanning. Scanning. Boogie. Boogie. Max, match velocity. Where the heck is match velocity? Uh, did we pass it? Hat right, IFC safety, strafe back, forward, down. Match velocity's off. Huh. Throttle up and down? Throttle zero. I guess we need to set that to a button here. There we go. All right, so at least that'll solve this issue here. Sorry about that, guys. Thanks for being patient. All right, so set that throttle to zero. And now we're back in business, boys. Oh, look who jumped in airspace. Yield cat nuts. Oh, I have one gun. All right, let's do this, boys. Shields charging. He's got no shot now, boys. We have one gun. Let's see if we can. Scanning. We take him out with one gun. Lock. I 
think we can. I think I can keep him on target here. Shields charging. Give him a three piece. Hang in there. Forward hit. <sighs> Shields charging. Shields charging. Right, Let's see if we can. So we're pretty banged up here. Shields. Let's see if we can slide in the DMs here. Let's go into Tom Cruise mode. Shields charging. All right, let's see if we go. Let's go to anyone there. Let's actually jump out of here real quick. Let's see if we can go get repaired and come back and give them a, a price to remember. So a couple of things just to note: our our controls are not set up perfectly, but they're I'd say it's probably eighty-five percent of the way there, which I'm cool with. Let's actually go to. Let's make our first sliding into the DMs. Hang tight. Of. We'll go to Cry Astro. There we go. Which will be nice. So we'll get this thing, our ship healed up. And then we'll get a chance to actually slide in the DM with a working control and see how well we can land here with our new setup. I'm gonna. I'm shooting for at least a 9 out of 10 landing at Cry Astro. We'll see how we do. Alright, so full throttle ahead. Spin this bad boy up. Where's your landing pads? Oh, there we are. Thanks for stopping by Cry Astro. Scanning. Hold while Scanning. Our systems connect. Okay. Space break. Space okay. break. Not bad. Alright, so that's a problem. So whatever I use space break, must not be space break. Because when I hit space break, it sent us into oblivion. Okay. So let's kill our Starter. throttle. So no hit. space break Shields for us, at least for now. It's coming after us. Shields charging. Shields charging. All right, let's see if we can slide in the DMs here, boys. No. We're trying our new landing system. No. All right. Well, this is a, an interesting episode. I know it's still just working out some of the the flight issues, but uh, thank you so much for tuning in. If you guys enjoyed it, clicking the like button helps out a great deal. And if you guys are interested in what my new setup looks like, I'll include uh, Amazon affiliate links in the description below if you guys want to check out the sticks that I'm using. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Later, guys.